Good morning and welcome back to my channel. Um, today as you can see by the title of the video it is how I blow dry my hair. Um, so this is what I do if you want to see how I get this look then carry on watching. If, but yes um, my fringe is really annoying me but I'll explain that later on in the video. Um, so yeah this is pretty much the end look so carry on watching if you want to see that. Just checking the teeth. Once I have cleansed and conditioned my hair, I obviously wrap it up in a towel once I've got out of the shower. And then I continue to obviously get dressed and do my makeup while some of the moisture from my hair gets soaked up by the towel. And then what I do is I gently take the towel off. So see when your hair is wet, it is it is at its weakest point. So you can kind of weaken the elasticity, which then kind of makes your hair damaged and weak quicker and more brittle and you get more split ends but your hair will get split endy anyway through everyday wear and tear but you know you don't want to kind of make it even more worse so what I then do I get to my fingers and I find my parting um, which is on the side now I've changed I change my hair a lot I'm a typical hairdresser I'm never happy with my hair and I always constantly want to change it and I'm sorry I'm looking at in the viewfinder for Trying to find my part, well, roughly. So, once you've found your part, or you like your part in, your hair should look a little bit more normal. Um, what I then do, I go in with some oil on the end. Now, I'm using L'Oreal's Mythic Oil. Um, I'm not sure if you can get this in Boots or Superdrug. Um, as I am a hairdresser, I do have like a wholesalers. And I use quite a lot, I will try and show you but it's kind of running down my hands and now it's in my hair. So any oil will do, obviously the more you spend on it the better the quality it will be but if funds are not on your side um, then obviously any oil will do. It, it just protects your hair from the heat if you don't like heat protectant and then obviously take the rest into my fringe and just kind of, oh that smells good. I have about two. I have the Mythic Oil and what's the other one? The Macadamia Oil. I like to switch it up because your hair gets used to things quite quickly and it can feel like it's not doing its best. And then I just wipe the rest on the towel. And then the next thing I do is obviously I go through with Tony and Guy's Label M Heat Protectant Spray. I've always used this ever since I worked at Tony and Guy back in 2011, which is when I pretty much started this YouTube channel actually. Um, so I find that this one only works for, well, works well for me. I'm like molting, literally molting. Really annoys me. <laughs> yeah, so I find that this works better for me like you know you could get someone that it doesn't work well on if that makes sense so like all the other ones in the supermarkets and like all the drugstores and everything else like that I feel like it doesn't actually do its job properly um, and uh, like I said with the oil um, the more you spend on it the better the quality it will be and I know Label M's products inside and out because I worked with Tony Guy and no I'm not sponsored by Tony and Guy, I just I used to work for them for three months, so yeah. So once I have done that, I try and leave my hair alone, which is uh, obviously uh, impossible. What I do is I grab my hair dryer. I am going to obviously fast forward this bit a little bit and obviously put some nice music so you don't hear the hair dryer. And I'm, I've got my Babyliss Pro um, hair, no, Babyliss Pro style, stylist tools. Yeah, which is a power light. I found it up in the um, up in the loft when I was moving, and I got bored of my GHD one. So what I will do is I will obviously start by obviously blow drying where the root naturally like falls, and then yeah, basically just follow what I do if you want to get the same result. Basically.
Okay, so then what I do after is I get my <laughs> Label M anti-static pin tail comb um, and I just go under and just kind of tease it slightly just so it can sit how I want it and then just go up under the sides. I only do it as a light one, which my hair quite likes to tease now. Then after that I fix, obviously fix it around and add hairspray and I'm using L'Oreal's Infinium. Only a light because I'm only going out and about today and my fringe is going to annoy me so it's it. Uh, I'm going to end up putting it up. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate and subscribe and more is coming definitely. Um, yeah. Right.